Adventures Animal Encounters. I'm your host, Charles Bryant, and today I have with me uh, one of our senior zookeepers, Amanda Davis. And she's going to talk to us a little bit today about these ring-tailed lemurs that are above us. These guys are wonderful animals, and without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and ask her to tell me a little bit about where these guys are from. Well, yes, Charles, these are ring-tailed lemurs, and these guys are actually from the island of Madagascar. Uh, it's a little island located off the continent of Africa. Now, all lemurs in the whole entire world that you will ever see anywhere originate from this single little island. Now, ring-tailed lemurs, those guys live right up there, up in the canopies, high up in the trees. So they like to jump around quite a bit. However, ring-tailed lemurs, they like to be on the ground a lot more. So they're a lot more terrestrial, too. All right, so we're going to get to feed these guys today, am I correct? Yes, we are. So do I get to feed them? Yes, you can. Oh, awesome. OK, you guys ready to eat? OK, looks like they're ready to eat. All right, we're going to get we're going to go see if we can get these guys to eat a little bit, uh, and we'll be right back with you. Okay, so here we are, feeding the lemurs. Let me see if I can get one to eat a grape. Looks like you've already got something. <laughs> Come on, buddy. I feel like feeding himself. Come on. Here comes one right now. Let's see if they'll eat this grape. Come on, buddy. Come on. Oh, that was so cool. <laughs> All right, well, tell me exactly what is the food that they eat. I mean, it looks like you've got some lettuce and some grapes and other fruits that I know, but then there's one thing in here that I don't know. It looks like wet bread. Well, you are sort of right. <laughs> it is wet and it is a type of bread. What these are, they are called monkey biscuits. Okay. They're a manufactured product just to give these guys all their extra vitamins and nutrients they need. Out in the wild, they've been eating a lot of the same types of fruits and veggies with a couple insects or lizards here or there. Now, there aren't any insects for lizards in their breakfast, so hence these little monkey biscuits. And I'll tell you a secret. These guys hate these biscuits. They hate them? Oh. Yes. For the most part, they would pick them up, sniff them, and then throw them at us. Oh, goodness. Oh. Well, after having enough stuff literally thrown in our faces, we discovered that if we soak these little biscuits in some juice, they'll absorb all that nice juice flavor. And these guys, they don't seem to mind them. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I have tried them. They're you not tried them? Bad. Yes. See, they're pretty good, right? Yeah, that's what yeah, I'll tell you, it looks like he likes that. All right, so since we've been in here, I've been hearing them making different types of sounds and noises with their mouths. Is that a normal thing that they do, or is that a communication thing with them? It absolutely is communication. These guys, they just talk amongst themselves, same way we do, same way cats meow, dogs bark. These guys, they make little cooing noises. Sometimes it's, hey, I want that, give me that. Sometimes <laughs> it's, get away, caution, there's someone over there. It right. just depends on what they're trying to say. That's awesome. All right, so I just have one more question for you. Now, if I'm not mistaken, lemurs are an order of primate. Yes, they are. Okay, so how intelligent are they? Well, these guys, they are an order of a primate. They are from simian. That means these guys are from the eastern hemisphere as opposed to the western hemisphere where our marmosets and our squirrel monkeys are from. Now, being a prosimian, they kind of have a bad reputation for not being as smart as the New World primates. Okay. However, Duke University has done quite a few research projects with these guys, and they work with lemurs very closely, and it's even been said that these guys can do easy, simple math problems. Wow, are you kidding? I was terrible at math, so let's not do that, because I don't want to you know, <laughs> be shown up by a ring for a lemur today. Uh, Amanda, I want to thank you so much for taking your time. I thank you. Enjoyed feeding these guys. Uh, they are wonderful, wonderful animals. If you guys have any more questions about ring-tailed lemurs, come on out to Alligator Adventure. Come see the shows. Ask us questions. We'll be glad to talk with you. Tune in next time for Animal Encounters at Alligator Adventure.